Hello everyone, uh, I'm Adzina, an Italian producer uh, under the name of Tadli. Uh, um, 36 years old and I was born in India actually. Uh, but I've been adopted when I was really, really young, so I spent all my life here in Italy uh, with my Italian family and Italian friends as well. Um, I started producing uh, when I was really young, I mean, uh, during my teenage, uh, and then I never stopped. Uh, now I play uh, as uh, Dudley with my live set of the underground experimental music uh, scene as well as a DJ sometimes. It's really hard sometimes, yeah. I had, I had bad experience uh, during my work, during my uh, logistic organization and personal stuff, some sexism and racism they are not they are not i mean a beautiful thing when you're working when you're doing your, your job uh, whatever your job is i hate waters <laughs> there's a thing that's the element that i always dream uh, I mean, very often, um, yes, in my dream is water in every form. I mean, ocean, lakes, waterfalls, and in these nightmares, I, I find myself in a hard situation, into the water, under the water, um, and have to escape, have to save my life, I have to keep me safe, I, I don't know, maybe something strange, something difficult, something hard. Um, and this is uh, an element that I dreamed from a very long time, when I was younger and see now, nowadays. So I think this is the biggest nightmare uh, I still dream about. Yeah, I have uh, my two blush. Uh, one is my first memory ever from my my arrival in Italy, and it's a yellow cat. Uh, and then the other one is like uh, it means like uh, my first pet ever. And uh, I think they could have me yeah, in that situation. I uh, really want them with me <laughs> in that moment, yeah. But about the question is an interesting question. Um, and the question is, which is the bad experience on your work, on your job, uh, you ever, ever had in your career or as a musician, as a producer. And my replay is that I was playing at the first and festival. I was playing live and um, I was on the stage, on the real stage, it's a big one. I mean, I'm, I, I wasn't on, on the floor. So, I mean, it was a really big stage. So you can understand a, a musician, a player who is doing his job. Um, I was, I was making my light set, and suddenly uh, I felt the, this guy on my on my left. And firstly, I thought it was technics. I was, I mean, for it was there for something technical to um, check the volume, to check I don't know something. And then this guy asked me. Can you play techno, please? And I say, what? No, no, man. Uh, I'm working. I am just. Please leave the stage. I mean, I'm playing live my set. Uh, please leave. <laughs> I don't know how these guys uh, jump in. Uh, I really have no ideas. But it was really, uh, it's really sad as 
behavior of the public. Um, and I'm sure, I'm really sure that if I were a man, if it was a man on the stage, this is what will never happen. Because a woman is never doing the, the, an important thing in the brain and the mental of the people. So this is really, yeah, I, I, today, today I think about it, about this fact. And I smile because a long, long time has passed, but, but it's insane. It's insane that this happens. I'm a big passionate about advertising and communication. I mean, I used to be an art director in some agencies uh, during my, my work with music, my, my stuff. Uh, I have to, have to say that it still interests me. I mean, I'm really curious about the campaign, about advertising, ATL, BTL, um, anything. Uh, I really, I still study the way the brand communicate. Um, I really love it. It's one of my passions.